Hello and welcome back to Boxer Gaming and, uh, and Nyx. Yes. And uh, you're fighting Koch and losing? Yeah, because they turn up with 20 stack on my border. Well, did you check their, their force limits and stuff? Yes. Oh. <laughs> this is all of their troops. And I'm about to go to war with... Ning, can't find them. How about you? Okay, Wu. All the crap. Wu has the second biggest army in the world, and I'm about to fight them. Well, that's not good. Um. Okay, so I'll be up against. About 60,000 troops total. Um, <laughs> that's probably a bad idea, isn't it? Yes. But, but, but they're blocking in my troops. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, let's unpause. Yes, let's, uh, let's... I need to think of a plan. You need to stay and sit somewhere. Defense. Uh, Bastari nationalists just crossed the border into my land. Yeah, because you, s you hold Bastar. <laughs> so I'm going to support rebels. Uh huh. With just. One ducat, and they will become friendly to me. But it's a bit gamey, take... but won't they still take over your provinces? No, because I'm friendly with them. Oh, okay. It's Good. the best way if, if people cross your border. Yeah. <laughs> Shampoo is just four provinces now. <laughs> Okay, this is so annoying because I can't get my troops out. Like, the game does not allow me to do anything except declare war now. Because, well, I can't get my troops out, so... I literally cannot do anything unless I disband, but then, well, I don't have any manpower, so that's that's a bad idea. Um... Yeah. <laughs> So the 20 stack of Koch is just staying there. What if I fight you, friend? Oh, that's much better. Alright. Holy crap, Chu is becoming massive. Chu and Dali are the biggest countries in, in in China now, and they're massive. I can see Dali. Uh huh. How about Chu? Nope. Chu is eating up all these other little countries. Alright. I'm gonna ferry my troops here, and I'm gonna declare war on Tang, or Tang. I'm gonna full annex them. Oh no, I can't. Well, re return all the cores as much as I can. Maybe returning cores costs less war score than the actual province costs. That that might make sense, actually. Yeah, I think that's true. Yeah, it w would make sense because, well, it's a core, so it's, you know. Anyways, there we go. Declare war. Oh my god. What happened? Please hang on. Oh, dang. No, it's fine. Oh. No, I had a 4 stack and a tw 25 stack of them just attacked me. I had to reinforce and I'm fine. Okay. War it is. So I'm not at war with half of China. Holy crap. 
It's fine. Oh, gotcha. Crush your armies. Oh, there's another 12 stack. Holy crap. What? Terhut joined as well. Why? Where, where did they come from? Probably their homeland. Ah, oh, they just... Oh, nice. Oh, holy crap, there's way more troops that I can handle coming. Oh dear, I need to fall back. I was not expecting that. Oh, Ming has peasant war. Well, peasant rebels. Oh, okay. My enemies are fighting the peasants for me. <laughs> oh, all of them are just running into this tent stack of peasants. <laughs> wow. Thank you. You're now at low morale. We'll Hang on, we're going to have to slow down a little bit because I'm actually close to losing this. Yeah, just go for it. Did not expect that to happen. Also, my I could probably win this, but my allies are not actually attached to me. Hmm. So I'm doing pretty good. I'm pretty happy. So I don't have any loans anymore. My war exhaustion is fine. The plus two stability. That's nice. Yeah, it's turning around. Can I please come in time? No, I won't. It's a one stack against a 24 stack. <laughs> <laughs> okay, F it. I'm just going to attack right into them. There we go. Okay, it's not so bad. I think I'll win this fight, and that means that I can start sieging a little bit. It's insane how many men uh, these Chinese countries have, though. But, the good thing is, I am at war with so many people that... I can, hopefully, just return course with all of them, separately. That would be pretty sweet, actually. I could probably get Ming to about 10 times the size of what they are now in one war. So, my general died again. I. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing to them, but. Well, they don't like me for sure. No. Well, I wouldn't either if my employer just got me killed every second. <laughs> well, you should stop complaining. Is that why they die? Because they complain. Okay, Key, you are the lucky winner of being taken out of this war first. Aren't you happy? So my vassal Ming has an opinion of minus 160. <laughs> I have aggressive expansion, minus 200. Oh, you can get plus um, 200 from improving relations. Yeah, I know, but they have minus 200 aggressive expansion towards me. Yeah. 
<laughs> I don't think it's gonna get any better. Ah, oh, thank you. Ning is attacking my peasants again. What is happening? Tehut is attacking Bengal and they are winning. There's a one province minor. Yeah, but Bengal is so broken. Yeah, because they have 14 troops, but they can't cross me. Oh. <laughs> I have lost the conquest to uh, Casas Belli against my own uh, my own vessel. How how sad. I'm still annexing uh, Jan. <laughs> it's a fifty percent. Question, question now is: Do I actually? What do I take from this war? From Koch? Yes. Well, at least the, the Shigatsi and Changtang. Because then you can yeah. get into uh, Kham. Or whatever it's called. I put on speed free, by the way, but feel free to. Uh, Cancel that. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. Okay, I now have forced the uh, force match. Nice. Now I can finally get a normal ID and catch up with military tech and stuff. I'm a military tech eight, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on six because of the IDs. But you know, I, at least, at least but I my have dip them. Diplo tech is four and admin tech five. Yeah, but Diplotech is completely not important. Or at least not much. If you're not colonizing and stuff, it's not really important. Oh my god. Pretend the rebels just killed my stack. <laughs> You love it when that happens. <laughs> That's pretty brutal. Holy shit. Whoa, there's an 18 stack coming. Hi. They just attacked me and I did not see that coming and I'm losing this fight. Because so my Koch wants, Koch wants to become my fast. Because my 13 stack of allies is just standing there doing nothing right next to me. A 19 stack. Like, I'm actually telling them to attach to me. And they're just not doing it. They're standing right next to me. And then when I get attacked, they just don't do anything. It's annoying. I'll just build a massive mercenary army. Okay, my allies are now following the army that had that had the attached attached to this unit on. But it's running, it's fleeing. <laughs> oh crap, my ally got into a fight now that they lost. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I'm doing pretty good. Hmm. Another stupid thing, right? I, I attacked this, this two province minor. And uh, they have both cores that belong to Ming. Okay? Yeah. I can full annex them, I have enough war score to full annex them, but I can't return both countries to me. Because, well you can't do that, you can't full annex someone by returning cores. So I have to full annex them myself. It cost me diplo power. Just return anything you can and then full annex them? 
I can't, because full annex is 100% war score. Oh, yeah. So, good to have. I have to. I can either full annex them and then just sell my provinces to Ming, but that will cost me 90 diplo pop, uh, points and a lot of aggressive expansion. Or I can just return one core and then five years later attack again and return the other core. <laughs> Which is what I'll do. It's just annoying. Doesn't make any sense. Okay. Let's uh, unpause. Just waiting for this single siege. So my ally is now losing uh, a two stack, four stack, a six stack, etc. Constantly. Instead of just grouping up with me once. <laughs> yeah, the AI is sometimes a bit weird. Yeah, it's weird because I, like, I set this setting, like, attached to this unit, you know? And they go, what? Nah, well, look, maybe, but no. <laughs> Don't wanna. Oh, now they're coming to attach, nice. Where's this guy going? Alright, 15 against 15, do I want to take this? Okay, this is the fight that's going to determine whether I lose territory or not in this war. Wow. So Tripura, which I was attacking as well, is just getting destroyed. By who? By everyone. Oh. <laughs> They had to release two provinces for rebels. They're pretty big though, Tripura. I've never seen them before. I think they they spawned. They're not in the game by default, I think. Yeah, they might. Okay, so I won my battle. Ooh, Bastar formed. Ah, oh, they have a claim on you. <laughs> yeah, but they're vassalized now. Wow, like instant? Yes. Because I was supporting the rebels there, so they like me instantly. Oh. I was thinking that seems awfully quick. Alright, next person to take out of this war is... Ning. I'm just going one by one to all their capitals and all their like I'm just carpet sieging country by country. Just need to uh, just see what I can do now uh -huh. with the peace. Okay. Um. It's always nice when you take Koch because. Um, Hey, I can see a lot, by the way. My vision expanded. I can see the Ottomans now. It's weird. Ethiopia and, and Kaffa and Adal and Alodia are almost exactly the same as when they started. Even Hedges and Najd and Hasa and the Oman and Yemen are about the same. Kara is about the same. Ottomans is about the same. Mamluks about the same. Nothing happened. <laughs> Okay, so I just need to unpause for just a little bit. Yep. Okay, good. Okay, fuck. This is going to be messy. Why did you have to unpause? Oh, shit. Oh, you pieced out a psalm first. Yeah, I pieced out a couple. And I just need to impulse for seven days. Mm -hmm. You're right. Go nuts. And then. Oh, I'm losing eight ducats a month. That's not good. 
So I just need to. Oh, I can do this. Okay. That is a long piece, deal. Yep, I'm done. Wow. What is your overextension? 60 something. Oh, it's not bad. That is not bad at all. Okay, so I started the uh, carpet sieging. The next candidate for uh, for Ming to take over. <laughs> I'm just slowly taking all the uh, cores from Ming back. I really wanted to get into Japan, but uh, this opportunity is just too nice. Anyways, we're uh, 20 min 21 minutes in, so uh, let's end it here for today. Yes, that's that's fine. Yeah, I mean you did well. You, you last episode you got uh, you got some serious land. Yeah, I'm clawing my way back again. Yeah, just don't move any more east because uh, I'll have to uh, I'll have to uh, come at you then. That's the way it works. <laughs> All right, thank you very much for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. Yep, see you.